Hello, Incitations! My name is John Johnson, and welcome to another episode of Yoshi's Island for the Super Nintendo. The Super, Super, Super Nintendo. Alright, first things first, uh, let me just address something here. As you can see, my scores are a little lower than usual on the end of this, uh, 40, 40, 24, 43, 34. Lots of fours in that for some odd reason, not sure how that happened. Uh, there is actually a reason for that, and it's the same reason as it was in the last episode. Had a little bit of an error and had to actually replay through those levels, but I did not really want to try and 100% them again, so I didn't. I just sped right on through them. And that actually brings me up to, uh, to an interesting fact about this game that I've never actually realized. This game is really fun to speedrun. Go, Mario, go! Speak of the devil. Oh, make that devils. <laughs> ah, references. So, we have our first, uh, first little instance of Goombas in this game, and they do something hilarious. I'm gonna eat that one because it's getting too close to the screen. Watch this. Ah, <laughs> oh, you can ride him. This, this is the greatest thing ever. Oh, I love it so much. Now die. <laughs> okay, enough of that. But yeah, that's cool. But anyways, back to what I was saying a while ago. I don't know why. I've, I've never been the biggest speedrunner for games, honestly. I mean, there have been a few games uh, I've attempted speedruns on just, just because. They're usually games I've played so much that I kind of speedrun whether I want to or not, just by force of habit. A uh, big example being Ocarina of Time. And by no means am I good at it, either. Ow! Goomba! Just for that, I condemn you to a life as a pancake. Uh, but yeah, they're- they're- I'm- I'm by no means good at it. Wow, I destroyed every one of those things. Come here, Shell, I need you. Dude, really? Shell! Go that way. Thank you. I need my billies, man! Uh, yeah, I'm- I'm not good at speedrunning at all. Like, not at all. I beat, a. Uh, Ocarina and Tom in, I, I don't know how many hours, like five, six, something like that. I don't know. But anyways, I don't, I, I may be completely off. I did it over the course of two days, and I just, I think it was like two, three, or four hours sittings. So I'm pretty sure it'd be about eight hours, uh, between six and eight hours, somewhere. Anyway, back to the game at hand. As you can probably see, or maybe you can't, if you look behind that little pink crystal there, there is a shy guy. And that little bastard is waiting on us. Do you remember, uh... A few episodes back, we walked behind the bush, and all of a sudden, Randy popped out, and we had a shy guy on her back. Yeah, you remember Randy. I hate Randy. Anyways, and he's still there. You can actually, he respawns really quick. And they're kind of douchey, because they actually put them, like, there's like eight or nine of them in this room. So you have to be really careful. Keep an eye on these here crystals. There's one right behind there, too. I just ate. Man, this is it's bad. It's bad. It's bad. It's by it. There's one. You can just barely see him through that crystal, too. See? 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 You see? Randy? Randy. Randy. No. No. <sighs> stupid shy guys. And stupid Randy. Just stupid. They just stupid, man. <laughs> Make me use up all my star points, all my billies. Oh well, at least I got some in that crate. And, by popular demand, I'm gonna start shooting, uh, ooh, I didn't really mean to hit that, but okay. I'm gonna start shooting enemies in these, well, maybe I'm not, you know what? <laughs> Apparently popular demand doesn't matter much with this game, because it just decided to ignore it completely. Really? It just went through it. What? What? Get in the flower, I need my billies. Uh, for those of you wondering, I am actually using the, uh, the freeze thing on the cursor. But you can do that, just so you know. I really don't like doing it, but again, people are have gotten kind of annoyed with me for trying to shoot eggs into here the hard way. So, okay, you know what? Let's jump off of this instead. Get some height, and that'll help. Or maybe it won't help at all, actually. You know, because maybe I just suck at this game. There we go. I mean, I gotta get my billies. I have no choice. Billies are a required part of any breakfast. You heard me. Alright, and there's this thing down there, which I don't really care about. What I do care about, however, is that red coin. So I'm gonna come and jump up here, get that, and then come down here. Er, yeah, come down here. Because there's some more red coins and lots of bullets. Lots of coins and bullets. <laughs> so I finally had somebody tell me uh, earlier today, 
that they couldn't watch my videos because of my accent. I've been waiting for that ever since I started LP before I started LPing. The reason I didn't start LPing sooner during my like four years watching LPs is because of my accent because I thought people would say that that they couldn't watch my videos no matter how good they are because of my accent. But uh, you know, six months or so after I started and like, almost 500 subscribers later. I finally had one person say they can't watch my videos because of my accent. And it was weird because he was actually really nice about it. He even said that he would uh, suggest me to his friends and other LP fans that he knows. But it's just like his personal thing, like he can't get past my accent in order to, to watch my videos. So, I'm not really mad. I mean, I, I guess I could be. Oh, yeah. Not again. Yes, we have the fuzzies. And we have something particular, particularly annoying that I don't think was in the first fuzzy level. And that is this music that's playing. Listen. You hear that, like, high-pitched slide note? Oh god, don't die. Yeah, that's really annoying. Ah, oh, friggin' fuzzies. Uh. Oh, that was easy. So, here we have a thing. Uh, this is kind of a rumor I've always heard about, about how this particular rock I'm standing on is supposed to be a naked woman. I mean, I guess I could see that. But I think people may be digging too far into that, honestly. So I, that's all I'm going to say about that. I felt like I should address it, though, because it is a fairly well-known little tidbit. So, yeah. Yeah, so let's get to halfway and come down here for our Super Mario Star. We're actually uh, going to let it lead on for a little bit because we need as much time as we can with these things. So we're going to let it get as far as possible before we go and get it. There we go. Oh, God. What? Why are you... What? Okay, get the... Uh, get... No. No. Okay. I don't know. It wouldn't... It wouldn't run. My plan was foiled quite, quite badly. Oh god. Get the thing, get the thing, with the thing, and the thing. Now there's a certain point we have to get up to in order to, to really get our use out of the star. We're not there quite yet, but we're close. There we go. Alright, once we're here, we're actually, uh, we're pretty good here. Now, with baby, baby Mario, you can try and get all these red coins. Oh, and we actually did. But, don't fret if you don't get them. Ah, stupid freaking mad butterflies. I eat you. I eat you dead. You can actually, uh, all of those red coins that I got are, are close enough to the ground that you can see them to shoot an egg at them. So, don't fret if you miss some with baby Mario is what I'm trying to say. My thought kept getting interrupted there. Did we 100? No, we didn't 100% that. But we did close. We practically did. We just didn't have enough stars. Again. It keeps happening. Scratch and match. Scratch three boxes and cover my ass to gain one. Oh, okay, it's a lottery ticket. This game teaches kids to gamble, I've realized. Well, we're off to a good start. <laughs> uh, let's try bottom right. Oh, hey, we got one. Now let's see if we can get another one. We can get at least two up from this. Let's see... Okay, this one. Nope! <laughs> I have horrible luck with this particular game for some reason. I'm good with the roulette game. I got, I have really good luck with the roulette game. I'm not so good with the, this lottery ticket game, however. Alright, 4-1 out down. Words. 4-1 down, 4-2 begin. The cave of the lack of oh crap! <laughs> ah, all right. I really hate this level, like a lot. It's not even for. I mean, it's not even hard. This this level is not hard at, at, at all. It's just really annoying. But we gotta do it anyways. Uh, if you want an easy one up, however, there is this little area. You go into the furthest left pipe, like I did. And wait for the timing, which actually, now would be a good time to use this freeze frame thing. Ah, oh, and I missed. Whip! I wonder if there's some way I can ricochet it. Although, I kind of doubt it. Uh, let's see. 
The point is, you're supposed to hit that egg, and it'll give you, uh, it'll kill all these, or not egg, hit that shit. Oh, yeah, I did it. Ah, uh, but I messed it up. You gotta jump over really quick. <sighs> well, that was a failure. Anyways, if you hit, if you hit it, and you'll get stuff, it happens. You heard me. <laughs> you get one-ups, okay? What do you want from me? You want me to speak English? Because I, I can't do that. I've, I've fairly well proven it. So, simple little little thought here. You just... You, it's Cave of the Lakitus. It's Cave and it's got a lot of Lakitus. And Billy, no! Billy! Oh, Billy. Sorry, Billy. Uh, there's a power block here. One of the few instances of a power block in this game. Ah, dang. Oh, Billy! <laughs> Is he respawning? Is the Billy respawning? Wait, 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 wait! I want to see if the Billy responds. Oh. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> I know it wasn't the same Billy, but I'm gonna pretend it is. Because it makes me feel better about letting Billy die. Man, speaking of, we have a lot of Billies here. Already up to 22 star points. Not the bad, if I do say so myself. Alright, so push this block. Or crate, I guess. It's not really a block. And they're gonna throw shells at us, because that's their lack of twos, and that's what they do. They can't really do a dang thing, so don't worry about them. And more Billies! Oh, God. Why so many billies? We're almost up to 30 star points already. Oh, let's make sure we keep them this time. Alright, I'm gonna try and take out all these Lectus before they can get a shot off and fail. At least they didn't hit me. There's not that many of them. Alright. Uh, I don't believe you can go down either one of these. Nope. And there is some red coins here. And then there's this thing. I don't know what the point of this thing is. And there's there's a few spots in this game that's like this. It'll have one of these little bounces. And it looks like there's a secret area up here. That's what it's supposed to be. But then you do it and there's... I don't know. Maybe one of you guys know? I have no idea. Maybe I know. Because I have 100% of this game before. It's like, I have done it. But I don't remember it, I guess. If it's something you have to get up there. Like a red coin. But either way. Going in this next room where some red coins are. And you basically just flutter. That's it. Flutter and follow the coins. And there are red coins hidden in here. So be careful. Because it's easy to miss them like that. Because yeah, I forgot to flutter. Ugh, if I get all of them in one pass, I'm going to be lucky. Usually it takes me like two or three tries. And if you miss some red coins, you do actually... Uh, the switch you press to get in here does actually respawn. So don't worry about it too much. You can try again if you miss. It takes five seconds. Not that bad. Not that bad at all. And we come out right here, right behind all this stuff, and like I said, you can try again if you want to. Uh, here we have a neat little game. They make you decide between hitting the cloud. Damn it. <laughs> they make you decide between hitting the cloud and the flower by shooting an egg at the uh, Koopa, and whichever way it's walking, the egg, will, uh, the shell of, the, of it will go that way, either collecting the flower or breaking the cloud. Oh, we can do like that if you mess up like I do and eat the Koopa. But uh, I don't actually know what's in that cloud because I've never, I've never broken it. It's not, it's, it's probably star points. That's my guess. Because it can't be something required like another flower or red coins or anything like that. Because otherwise you wouldn't be able to 100% this. I mean, well, I guess you could go off screen and let the, uh, the shell respawn. I guess you could do that. Oh, and we messed up. That shell was supposed to go in there. Uh, let's try that again. Why is it... Why is it doing that? That's weird. It's supposed to go down the stairs... What? I don't understand, Mr. Red Shell. Why are you failing? Huh. Uh, Maybe I can shoot an egg in there. Oh, that. Nah. That's not gonna work. Oh, well, I guess we're not getting that flower. How wonderful. That has never happened to me before, oddly enough. Get the key. Get the red coin. Don't let the red coin fall into the pit of death. Weird. I don't... Maybe it has to go through all these enemies. Here, let me try that. Because, I mean, when it happens, it's kind of a blur here. See, no, what? What the crap was that? Okay. Okay. Let me try and get these enemies to respawn again. And try this. Because this is this is annoying me greatly. I don't understand why this is happening exactly. 
Maybe I'm rushing too fast and I'm I'm catching up with the shell or something. I don't I don't know. Let's see. Oh, it's not the shell. It's the uh, wait. It was a shell. What? Okay, whatever. I don't care. Moving on. <laughs> For a minute there, I thought maybe it wasn't the shell. It was the enemies that or that twir uh ghost lantern guy thing. But then he fell through. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I just don't know. I didn't design the game. Don't ask me. Blah blah. blah. And I have to concentrate on this because my buttons are reversed. And I don't know what I'm doing. I lost this in practice earlier. Let's see if I can actually get it now. I think I won one of these on camera, didn't I? I know I won a few in practice. But I don't know I don't remember if I won one of these on camera or not. Hopefully we can we can win this one and and and, and oh, what the I ran out of time. I ran out of time. I ran out of time. Ran, ah darn it. I stopped to look at my control for a minute, and I looked back up, and it had started over, and it messed me up, and I died. Crappy. Oh, well. That's definitely the hardest minigame to play for me, just because of the fact that I'm using uh, an Xbox controller for this, actually. So, that sucks. But oh well. We're not hurting for items or anything anyway, so I'm not hugely worried about it. Ugh. We do have a particularly annoying flower to get here, and let me get this like two out of the way so it doesn't bother me. Alright. As far as I know, oh god, no, no, no. <laughs> as far as I know, the only way to get this is to actually daredevil jump and oh, oh, do that. Oh, heart attack. Hold on. Let me breathe for a minute. Uh, as far as I know, that's the only way to get that flower. So, just be super careful. Alright, here we got some more red coins that we're gonna get. Pretty easily. And that was the last red coin. And here we got, I believe, the last flower. Now, this one's kind of forgiving because it will ricochet some if you don't just have a direct hit like I did. It will ricochet some and, uh, probably collect it anyway, so it's pretty forgiving there. Let's see, did we 100% this one? Did we? Did we? Oh, we didn't get a bonus game. That sucks. Oh, well. I said that a lot this episode. Stop it. And, yeah, yeah, those are going to get more and more scarce as this LP goes on. I've said like five times now. Well, uh, thank you guys for watching today. I really do appreciate it. As always, like if you like, leave a comment, tell me what I did right, what I did wrong. Subscribe if you want to see more and share with your friends. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Mmm, crappy.